the very first time school board elections will be held in the fall instead of during the May primary. And experts say it could have a significant impact on voter turnout. RTV6 reporter Kara Kinney joins us now with the story. Kara? Today is actually the first day candidates could formally submit their paperwork to run for school board. School board candidates will be on the November 6th ballot instead of the May primary, and some say it could have a big impact. At the Marion County Clerk's Office, it's the first day school board candidates can submit their paperwork. You do have to collect 10 signatures of registered voters within your school board district. Typically, more than 70 candidates file to run for seats in 11 Marion County school districts, but this year isn't typical. We'll see. This will be new for us, too. It's the first time school board elections will be held in the fall, alongside contests for governor, Senate, and the President of the United States. A general election will always have more uh, turnout than a primary, just because of the nature of it being a general election, and a lot of people don't like to declare political parties. So that's always going to keep people away. An RTV6 political analyst and the clerk's office anticipate heated school issues will also bring people out, like school bus fees in Franklin Township, the superintendent payout controversy in Wayne Township, and the state of education in IPS. One school board member could make all the difference in the total complete direction of the IPS school board. The first two candidates to file Wednesday are both running for IPS school board. I filed today because I've been working on this for a while now. Um, this has been my intent since the beginning of the year. I've, I've worked hard for this up till this point, and I just wanted to get out there and be one of the first ones. Are people upset? Yes, but we need to show that there are people out here who want something different. One possible issue that could hurt school board elections this fall. They're so far down the ballot because there's so many other issues at the very top. I'm not sure as many people will stick through, you know, that ballot voting. Six people filed to run today. The deadline is noon on August 24th. Kara Kenny, RTV6.